Biodiversity. What is it? How it affects you? And how one country is dealing with it? Join me on a non-stop adventure to discover all of this and more. Forests, rivers, mountains, plants, animals, oceans, the atmosphere, you, me, everything. Our planet is gorgeous because it is diverse and everything is interconnected. Let's imagine that these blocks represent the millions of species we share this planet with, each dependent on each other in one form or another. Now, if one species goes extinct, no one would notice. If a second or third species goes extinct, some people might take note. However, if more and more species go extinct, then one day, everything might just collapse. These magnificent creatures ruled the Earth for millions of years before they went extinct 65 million years ago. They became extinct due to their inability to adapt to climate change. That drastic climate change may have been caused by an asteroid impact. But today's extinction of species is mainly caused by human activities. Fortunately, more and more people are taking steps to protect our natural world. The Milu deer border extinction toward the end of the 19th century. To resuscitate the species, Chinese researchers reintroduced 38 of them in this reservation in 1985. Decades later, the population of these deers have risen to over 10,000 in the country. Numerically speaking, the Milu deer is as rare as the panda. Speaking of pandas, the panda conservation program was so well orchestrated and executed, the pandas today are no longer classified as endangered species. In recent times, human activities have accelerated the decline of fertile land into deserts. These new deserts are a threat to human life. Few people can imagine that a desert barren of any plants can be transformed into a vibrant forest. And it all started here, with these 60-year-old trees. Hand-planted one by one, they become part of the world's largest man-made forest, covering a total of 750 square kilometers. In fact, Sai Hanba has been honored with the UN Champions of the Earth Award. This green miracle is the result of these humble saplings. As trees grow, they help reduce our carbon footprint. Burning fossil fuels produces carbon dioxide that makes our planet warmer and increases the threat to biodiversity. Electric vehicles have zero emissions, making transportation cleaner and greener. Fully understanding this, Chinese people in 2019 bought and used more electric vehicles than all other countries combined. Harnessing the power of Mother Nature, we're today able to transform wind power into electricity. Clean energy resources help reduce carbon emissions and protect the environment. In line with its green earth commitments, China produces about a third of the world's total solar capacity. All these efforts are paying off. This weather station records details through ultra-sensitive instruments. The information is fed to the computer here, which then interprets all that data. Over the past nine years, a Beijing citizen has been taking pictures of the sky. The change of air quality is prominent. You can clearly see how stringent air management has brought about positive results. Green mountains and clear rivers are as valuable as mountains of silver and gold. China pledges to achieve high quality and sustainable growth while pursuing harmony between man and nature. 
ecological advancement and conservation have been enshrined into China's constitution. This philosophy is guiding the country's overall plan for greener economic and social development in all aspects and strengthening its role in global environmental governance. From comprehensive recycling to renewable energy, from restoring forests to reducing carbon emissions, from laying out green concepts to formulating development strategies. As you can see, China walks the talk. Our planet has finite resources. Every drop is precious. Every ounce is irreplaceable. Every little bit counts. We all share this planet together. From green vision to green development. What we do affects everyone else. After all, it is our moral duty to leave the earth in a better condition for our future generations. And it all starts with you and me. I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them blue for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonder. Yes, I think to myself.